The new Pet Simulator X update is almost here, and I have so many things to show you guys. And that all ranges from things that could be added into the game to things that we know are coming to the game. And let me tell you, this new update is probably going to be a really good one. Now, to obviously start off with the most pay-to-win news, which most people will not like, they are actually adding two brand new Titanic pets into the game. Now, they may actually already be in the game at the moment. If you search up Titanic, I don't think they are. Yeah, they are not in the game at the moment. But these two slots right here will be getting filled out really soon. Let me show you what's going on. In approximately two days from the time I'm posting this video, the Titanic plushies will be dropping. And this time, it will be the Titanic tie-dye cap plush as well as the Titanic tie-dye dragon plush. Both come with codes, and obviously you can get your own Titanic pet, similar to how I did with the Titanic Capybaras and the Titanic Luckies. Now let's get to the good news. The really good news is the fact that we have a brand new update countdown gift. With the new update, you will be able to hatch new pets from this penguin egg. I've actually managed to get some leaks for those too, so I'll show you guys that in a second. Now with this brand new update, we are likely to get a new area added to the limbo world if you guys didn't know the current world that we have is literally the number two world which is the kawaii world and well the kawaii world has been there for some time so it's about time i guess replaced or added on tubes with something else and the reason that I say that is because we have so many new pet leaks. Now, if you guys want to see these leaks really early for yourself, join my Discord server, link in the description. But let me show you guys what's up. So as you guys can see, we have three brand new pets right here. The Stealth Dragon, Stealth Cat, as well as the Stealth Bobcat, all coming in the brand new update. Now, not only that, we actually have new party pets, such as the Party Squirrel, the Party Shock, and the Party Penguin. And and all of these will be inside of the gift egg, which you can get for staying in the game at the one minute mark. But even better, as you guys can see, the exquisite parrots, elephant, and the cat are also going to be coming this update. And I have a lot of theories on what that is, as well as a huge party penguin for the people who are getting the hugest from the gifts. They did also leak this tiger kawaii, so I'm not sure what this is, but we'll figure it out. Now, the genre of this update is a little bit weird because not only do we have stealth pets, we also have crown pets. Now, the last time we had to do something with crowns, it brought us the three new huge pets, which we have the huge crown Pegasus, huge crowned Corgi, as well as the huge crowned cat. And ever since then, those have been the pets that were added. So this could mean that they are giving such a price out once again to the top people that are supporting the game. Or it could literally also be for a brand new egg which we will get in the new update. Now there's a lot of things that I want to personally suggest that get added in this update or the next. And let me know if you guys like these. If you guys do and you have your own suggestions, comment them below in the comment section. I always love looking at your suggestions and seeing what they could possibly add. Now for the first question or the idea guess suggestion that i have is that they should add a new type of token system if you guys don't know in the exclusive shop you are able to basically buy everything for only robux like everything in here you have to use robux to buy now tokens would be completely separate from gems and all kinds of normal currencies tokens would actually be a trading currency similar to diamonds however except the one one token would equal to one robux so if you want a token you'd have to spend one robux now you may be asking, well, isn't that literally just pay to win? No, actually, that is where it's not. Because with the tokens, you will be able to spend them on game passes. So if you cannot like buy Robux or something, or you simply just want to buy tokens so you can trade them with people, um, you can do that. And well, one, it's very good for the developers because they'll be more likely to make more money. And number two, it's a lot easier for non pay to win players to be able to get game passes you know you will not have to spend robux and all you would have to do is just trade for the tokens and for example if i get like 49 tokens i will be able to buy this 100 times triple coins boost so it's really cool and i think it would help the game so much 
Now, for the next suggestion I actually have, we need to go to the trading plaza. So, here we go. Now, currently, as you guys know, the auction board actually allows you to auction huge pets as well as Titanics and exclusive eggs. Now, if you try to actually uh, convert an exclusive pet, which I think I hopefully have, um, yeah, let's go try the jelly pig. You know, if I want to put it at, I don't know, 5 billion, I cannot actually do it, and I can only do huge Titanic as well as exclusive eggs. Now, there's actually some really OG pets in the game, which you guys may not know about, and I believe I have some. However, I do have to find them. Uh, yeah, I do. Like, look at all of these OG g pets right and i think these are just og enough pets but for example guys this doge pet bro there's so little of them there's like seven thousand of these in existence and this is a part of the first ever one of the exclusive pets to ever be released when the game first came out same goes with things such as the chest mimics now, I do believe I actually have a really rare one, if I can find it. And yeah, here it is, my Nebula Dragon. Now, this is actually really rare because this goes for a lot of value considering the fact only 700 of these ever exist. And actually, half of these have probably been crafted into huge machine eggs already. Making this pet literally the rarest exclusive pet out there. But the bad part is I couldn't even auction it if I wanted to. Here, let me go ahead unlock it and try it out let's say i want to do the nebula dragon one trillion boom i literally cannot auction it although it has so much value so it'd be really cool if pets such as those that have a lot of value can actually be auctioned now i have another suggestion which a lot of you guys will like but for that we need to go back to the main game now the sad thing is that in the game ever since release there has really been only two rank rewards one at the spawn and one in the vip area if you actually even have it now i've already actually redeemed this one i do not remember doing that just like i don't remember the last time my dad was here but the point is uh is that they should really start adding these into further worlds because i mean it, it, they are good and like i don't know they just need to be further out in the game to where you can also use them there so there should be multiple of each every so often that way you can get a lot more diamonds a lot more boost and a ton more stuff because right now the only way to actually get boost really effectively is probably just the daycare system because i mean it's just so overpowered like boom i can claim that and boom i literally got like over 100 of every boost and this does not take long because every time i want to do this all i have to do is stay in game for two hours and i just get all of those free boosts which i will not complain about definitely but it's just too easy now i really hope one of the devs are watching this and if you are definitely take some notes you know i feel like a lot of these would be really cool to see and so many people would be happy and i can say that because i feel like they've added so many things that i've suggested before such as like the booths and things like that so i think this could potentially make it into the game and oh my god like i've suggested this every video is please bro add more upgrades what are y'all doing bro we need more upgrades literally in the newest update they actually removed one of the upgrades because they made it free for everyone so it'd be really nice if we could get all of these upgrades again but um i don't know we just literally need more upgrades in the game also it would be really nice to see an expansion of the diamond mine for example you can go to the mystic mine and just go further down here to where it like gets even more expanded which would be super cool since not gonna lie i don't think anybody uses the mystic mine anymore bro like if i break this how much am i gonna get yeah this is really not that great right now i believe the um what's it called the maze is better so if you guys want gems go grind the maze i did make a whole video on how much gems you can get out of it but another thing you guys should know is that this update the cinco de mayo event is probably going to be going away so um expect this to go away very soon so i really recommend you guys get the best pets as possible with this update we could also actually get more quests because if you guys don't know i believe you can get up to fifteen thousand points in total but i mean everything in the store doesn't really add up to that so they could have an expansion for this as well as adding more stuff because it does say coming soon right here and bro i still have yet to get the pet slot trust me i'll get it soon
And there should be like a pretty big buff to stuff such as the masteries here because if you guys don't know this daycare mastery is so hard to complete and all of these other ones bro they're also really hard to complete so like I feel like it would be better if these were made a little bit easier to complete considering the fact that every player kind of needs all of them and if they don't if they're not easy to complete then it's kind of hard for everyone also please add like pet teams into the game because if you guys don't know right now yes you can equip whatever pets bro but sometimes you want to like make pet teams of specifically cartoon pets and you can't really do that because you'll have to unequip all of them once again place them in your bank and get the new pets that you want so it would definitely put a lot less stress if you could just make it into a team and it would be so good now, I still have so many more things to suggest. It would also really be cool if we had things such as hardcore private server. Now, I can see why the developers have not actually added this. And that's simply because, as you guys can see, I'm right now in my VIP server. However, whenever I join hardcore mode, it will automatically take me to a public server. And there is simply no way for the developers to go around this and make it to where it takes me to a VIP server. Yeah, as you guys can see, we are literally literally in a public server with all people that I've never met in my life. And that's simply because the developers literally can't do anything about that. However, I have a very easy solution. Similar to a lot of anime games, if you, for example, own the VIP game pass, it actually allows you to click um, the mode that you want to go to, such as hardcore mode. Now, I assume this was just saying hardcore mode, but you would basically be able to click it and then make a server right here. And this would send you to a server which is dedicated only to you. And basically, you will have a code in which you can give out to people and they can join your server. You can also refresh the code if you decide to, you know, not have that server anymore. I can also go ahead and show you guys an example real quick. Okay, here we are in this anime game. Just ignore everything. But right here, as you guys can see, I can either join a friend by typing in their username or create a private server. Now, to have a private server, I have to actually own this game pass, which I do not right now. But this will basically generate a code in which I can type in and click join server to join that server. So this would definitely help so many people out. Now my next suggestion is actually a plus one egg hatch or plus two, it doesn't matter. Now how would this would work is basically from the shop, this would could, could literally just be the coming soon right here. And I mean, there is nothing else here that I don't think like the developers have planned. So it'd be really cool if like you could hatch two eggs at once if you don't have the game passes or four eggs or even nine eggs, depending on what game passes you have it would help out free to play players a lot and basically everyone in general another thing which would be really nice is if you can drag more than a hundred or 50 pets out once in your mailbox or not in your mailbox but your bank and as you guys can see you can only drag up to 50 pets out once and any more than that you cannot actually do same goes with i believe depositing pets so yeah you can only deposit like 50 pets at once it does not let you do more than that so it would be really nice if you could do like around 100 considering i know they only added that because of like duping and such but duping has not been in the game for like a very very long time another thing so many people have been asking for is similar to the huge hell rocks which we actually have right here as you guys know there is like 1.4 million of these that have ever existed now there's a lot less obviously ever since they added the evolve machine in which you could basically place in all of your hell rocks just like so and it would give you this egg now this egg basically gives you the huge pet just evolved instead and let's see will i get a rainbow or shiny maybe no okay um but yeah it literally gives you an evolved which is pretty cool but a lot of people are asking for a new huge pet similar to this but um also easy to get you know like one in fifty thousand or something now a lot of the recent huge pets have been really easy such as the bunny and uh things such as that but it would still be really cool if we could get something like that. Now, although I have a lot more suggestions, I'm only going to say one more for this video. Now, the last one, I like to call it the worldwide event. Now, the worldwide event could last around an hour, and basically what the event would be is basically you have five times extra luck, 
five times extra damage as well as meteors spawning a hundred times more often or well you could change that number i don't know if a hundred times is a little bit too much but basically a lot of things would be a lot more advanced it's kind of like in happy hour where basically you can hatch huges a lot easier and things such as that for a specific hour every single day now the hour could change day by day so that everyone that you know is in different time zones gets to see it but yeah just a little idea i had pretty cool to see if we get it in the game but if you guys enjoyed this video watch the video on the screen it's one of my best videos yet and i promise you will enjoy it and until then i will catch you all in the next one have a great day